I'm sure recently you've heard all the talk about Abadi Beach, mm. Snits, Snits um, having stakes in some of the hotels, mm. and the matter of profitability and the movement towards selling some of these ones. What's your reading of this? Right. Uh, let me trade cautiously here. Because as an association, mm -hmm. you know, we register uh, the owners of the hotels. We don't really meddle in their internal operations. So we don't care who is the owner of a hotel. So long as you meet the Ghana Tourism Authority's uh, registration mm -hmm. process, then we register you to a company. But uh, putting that aside, uh, you know, when you look at all the hotels that have been mentioned in the mm -hmm. whole process, mm -hmm. It is obvious that Labadi Beach Hotel has been doing quite well yes. or very well mm -hmm. in the past uh, few years. Mm -hmm. When you look at La Palm, it's obvious to all that things are not going that well. Not just as decent to Labadi Beach. Yes. Very good. So then there are some question marks there. Mm -hmm. And then you go to Elmina Beach Resort, yes. they have big challenge. Mm -hmm. We had a neck meeting in October last year, mm -hmm. and I was very sad because this a massive investment that was made some years past. It's decaying. And yes, it's decaying. Okay. So those ones, some points can be made about the need to restructure investment or mm -hmm. even bringing others on board. Mm -hmm. So the issue has been with Labadi. And unfortunate thing is the political twist. Mm -hmm. So the only thing I can say is that, you see, when you go into the scriptures, it says that everything is permissible, but not everything is beneficial. Okay. That's all I can say. 